Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we're excited to provide an overview of the new updates to the Link app. With version 4.1, we have updated the design to offer a cleaner, less cluttered look and provided clearer explanations for features and functionality. The first of these is the addition of information tabs. Information tabs have been added across multiple sections for easier navigation regarding features or characteristics of particular profiles. These are super easy ways to learn more about your link. So where will you see these? The first two information tabs are found in the preference menu. One to explain the advanced settings. The other to explain the voltage and density tube setup. The third information tab is found in the profile selection mode. This explains the function overview of the three selections that can be made here. The fourth information tab will appear when making an espresso selection. It explains how the user's espresso style preference works. The last information tab will be found on the solutions pages, which explains the details of the roast plan that the algorithm has chosen. Moving on. The second app amendment makes it easier to save preset defaults. This allows users to now save their voltage settings and density tube version as their default setup. Saving the need to select settings for every solution entry, making the process more convenient and time-saving. It is important to note, although you will see the preferences that have been selected, you can no longer change these settings in the data entry phase. Any changes to these default settings will now need to be made by going back into the preference menu. The third amendment to the Link app is to add user preference input into the Espresso workspace. This will prompt the user to select their preferred Espresso style and help the algorithm choose a more suitable roasting plan. To accommodate this input better, we have added three new Espresso plans. Espresso D, E and F are the new profiles designed to give users more options and a better chance of achieving their desired characteristics right from the first roast. The last app-based correction is to enhance the solution data for the manual profile selection space. This enhancement includes more information for DTR% percent suggestions for cupping profiles. This is specifically for more advanced users looking to customize their approaches in this roast style. These updates are based on our work with various private auctions and custom profiles we've curated, allowing the link users to be guided into exploring greater potential from their cupping roasts. And that's a wrap. As always, happy roasting.